this whole thing started 45 years ago when I drew a car on my grandfather's living room wall. That's when I realized that how cool and how beautiful cars are. And I got infatuated with cars. And it's always been my dream to create and to build my own supercar. Miss R represents the paradigm shift of EVs surpassing traditional combustion engine cars in both performance and capability. The core idea behind the prototype is to achieve game-changing performance levels and driving experiences that are otherwise impossible to achieve in gasoline-powered vehicles. It features a battery pack capable of outputting 1 megawatt, which is equivalent to 1,341 horsepower. And four wheels are driven by four independent motors, therefore making the car accelerate and handle incredibly. Miss R is the world's first rally-inspired electric supercar. It has the capability to go from the track to the road and off-road. So completing the first off-road test was a big milestone and validation of kind of our basic engineering concepts as far as having push rod suspension on an off-road car which is very unusual. Uh, we still have a lot of work to do but we also saw that damper performance was quite good, that our basic power distribution was very balanced and, and handled well, but also we got the beginning of our durability testing with some of the bumps and dust and everything that we saw in the off-road test. And all the test was quite successful and gave us the data we need to drive forward with the design. Being as cool as Supercar is, Ms. R is actually not just a toy to go fast, not just something to have fun in. But it is also a research and development platform where we innovate advanced electric vehicle technologies. Albert Einstein famously said, play is the highest form of research. By building fun to drive, sporting purpose, extreme performance vehicles, we also develop technologies that will power commercial and industrial vehicles like buses, construction equipment, delivery trucks, and snow plows. Vehicles that drive the world's economy and society.